Hi, in this video, we are going to see about a Java web application project which is entitled as Predicting Suicide Intuition in Online Social Network. Before seeing the execution of the project, let me brief about this project. So from the title of the project, we can come to know that we are going to predict the suicide related post in the online social networks. So nowadays we can see lots of users using the social network like sites like Twitter kinds of thing. And we can see there are lots of user posting text on various kinds of emotion some may be feeling happy some may be in sad part some may be in different kinds of moods so now in this project so we are going to build a similar social networking site with the basic features in it and in the admin part we are going to predict the tweets or the post that is posted by the user which contain the suicide intuition so as mentioned we are going to develop this project in java so this project can be executed in windows 10 or 11 the coding language that we have used is java the front end part is jsp html CSS, javascript jdk version is jdk 21 id tool is apache netbeans id 20 tomcat server is apache tomcat 9.0.84 and the database that we have used is mysql database so here in the system architecture you can find the entities user and the admin where the user can able to register login they can view the timeline view profile send and view messages to the users in the admin part they can view the user detail they can see all the tweets from the user and they can analyze the suicide related tweets from the users so this is the overall system architecture of the project quickly let us see the ppt of the project so in the abstract part it contains the overview of the project you can see about the existing system so in the existing system we don't have this analysis of or categorizing the suicide related posts so those details have been mentioned in it and you can see the list of disadvantages that is available in the existing system so in the proposed system we are going to address the limitations of the existing system and we are going to create a new type of social networking platform with the user friendly interface in it so, and you can see those details in the proposed system and you can see the list of advantages for the proposed system these are the list of advantages of the proposed system and system architecture hardware and software requirements so before the execution make sure that you have installed the exact version of jdk mysql and all the details that is mentioned in the help file now let us see the execution of the project so open apache netbeans id 20 first step you need to import the project into the netbeans id so first go to the file menu and click open project now go to the project source code location where you can find the source code folder inside that you have this suicidal ideation detection just select this and then click open project now kindly wait till the complete project is loaded into the netbeans id it takes few minutes meanwhile let us attach the database in the mysql so just go to the mysql administrator login with the user credentials of username and password root and root and now in the left side panel you can see the restore option just select this restore option now in the right side panel you can see the open backup file just select this open backup file File. now go to the project location where you will be having the database folder inside the database will be having the database just select this database and then click start restore so now you can see the restore operation was finished successfully message and click close so now we can close this mysql administrator part because we successfully attached the database now coming back to the netbeans ide you can see the project is loaded in completely into the netbeans ide now let us execute it just select it and then right click it and then click run now kindly wait for a few minutes So now it asks for the authentication of other Tomcat server. I have given admin and admin and click OK. So now it is navigated to the browser part. Now you can see the home screen. Welcome to the project with the project title predicting suicide intuition in online social network. So as mentioned, we have two entities, user and the admin. So first let me go to the user part. 
so I am going to uh, a new user I'm not having any username and password so I'm going to register so just click this register button so it will be navigate to the registration page for the user sign up so just enter the details of the user I'm just entering the details like name name date of birth email ID gender phone number address password and select a profile photo make sure that the photo is some small size don't upload any big size so it may not throw any conflict in it I'm just selecting this photo and then click sign up so now you can see the registration is success now so now let me it is the old uh, navigated to the user login page now let me enter the email id of the user which i have given during the registration the password and then click login so now you can see the login is success now it is navigated to the user's home page so this is the user's home page so user have the option of seeing the timeline so it is empty you can see the followers who are all the followers available and you can see the following who or whom we are following and everything now it is empty and you can see the profile so just go to the profile you can see the profile welcome jp the name data but whichever we have given using the registration part it is shown so now in the timeline you can see who are all the members there is no members available so it is empty now all the tweets everything is empty so now let us create some user before that let me go to the admin part so let admin as single username and password that is admin and admin everything is small letter and click login so now the admin is success or it will be navigated to the admin's home page this is the admin's home page where admin can see the user details just click the user details you can see the user details so here as i have created only one user now so the user id is one jp those details are displayed here if you go to user tweets you can see all the tweets that is posted by the user will be displayed here currently there is no tweet posted so it is empty and you can see the analysis so in the analysis part only we will be seeing which are all the tweets are having the suicide intuition will be categorized here so now let us log out from this admin part i'll go to the user part so i will create some two to three users to show you how the online social networking platform it works so let me create a user called alice i will create a date of birth for this person email id as alice at gmail.com phone number address password profile picture and sign up so this alice user is success now let me create another user uh, let me create uh, bob bob at gmail.com phone number address password and a profile picture and click sign up so now i have created another two user total there are three users now if i go to the user login of jp first user which i have created so now if you go to the timeline you can see all the member details earlier we could have seen that there are there are it is the table was empty now you can see alice and bob the two users has been created so now you can see i am not following anyone so it is empty so now let me follow alice let me follow now you can see alice is following now let me follow bob also so now you can see both are following if you go to following now you can see the users who am i following is been updated here now you can see in followers it is empty now so now let me log out i'll go to the alice login and click login now if i go to the timeline you can see i will follow jp now this user now let me log out now i am i'm going to the jp user Now if you go to followers you can see Alice is now following JP that has been updated here. So here uh, we have another option of messaging also just click message so they can directly message instead of posting 
publicly in the timeline they can directly message for example i'll just message to alice so i'll just click message and type i this is jp just select any some image for this and then click send now let me log out and go to the alice login so now if you go to that uh, message part view message part you can see the inbox so here you can see who are all the users their direct message to this person is being updated you can see the username jp you can see the date and time which time they send this message what is the message and photo so here again they can also reply by clicking the message they can able to message back hi I'm doing good and select some photo for this user and click send so now let me log out let me go to the jp user now and go to the view message you can see the message which is sent by alice time what is the message is been updated so these are all the features that is available in the online social network so similarly we have developed with those minimum features so now let me go to the timeline and post some tweet so now if you go go to the home page i'll just go to the tweet so let me type the tweet good morning all get ready for results i'll just select some image for this purpose and make the tweet so now if you go to the timeline you can see the tweet made by jp what is the tweet it is been updated here so now if we uh, uh, i will just log out from this part in from this part i will just go to the admin and show you so here you can see the user details here there was one user now you can see other two user if you go to the user tweets the there is one tweet posted by jp so that is been displayed here so in the analysis part you can see there is no any suicide tweets because it was a general tweet only so now i'll go to the alice user and now let me go to the timeline you can see the message posted and now let me go to the home and make a tweet so now here in the tweet i am i will post as i failed in my exams i am going to make so side i'll just type this message uh, as a post here and just select an image and click tweet so now let me log out and go to the admin part So if you go to user tweets, you can see all the tweets that is posted. So earlier there was one tweet. Now you can see the second tweet post by Alice. So now if you go to analysis part, you can see automatically the tweet posted by Alice is separated and shown here. So this is a suicide related tweet. So it has been categorized automatically, showing the Twitter ID, user ID, name, and what is the tweet of it. So in this way, it has been categorized. Uh, let me go to the graph part so here you can see the positive tweets and negative tweets ratings here this is a sample static graph only it is not a dynamic graph so based on the twist posted it is being uh, shown positive and negative so now let me log out now this time i'll just go to uh, the third user bob and let me go to the tweets now i'll post another tweet i'm feeling depressed mind i'll just select the image for this post and make a tweet so now let me go to the admin part to see that classification 
and in the admin you can see the user tweet the tweet that is posted all the tweets that is born given here if you go to analysis part now you can see that the the tweet that is posted by the third user bob is also categorized as a suicide intuition because it is had the word depressed so i'm feeling depressed mind so in this way the suicide intuition tweets have been classified and it is been updated in the admin part so in the graph part as it said it is a static graph only it is not going to change according to the user input so it remains the same only so let me go back and let me log out so let me go to the user part and log in with the first user so this user has not posted anything about the suicide so let me post take care so now let me log out go to the admin part again you can see the categorization so just go to the user tweets you can see the fourth tweet post by the user jp but if you go to analysis part you can see only the two tweets of alice and bob because jp has not posted anything related to the suicide intuition so in this way the the suicide intuition is being predicted in the online social network so how many number of tweets or how many number of users it can handle and everything will be categorized and shown in this way we can prevent the suicides of the users in the online social network so now let me log out from this part this is all about the project predicting suicide intuition in online social network using java and thank you for watching